to hi Rick. Hi. We haven't met. It's nice to meet you. It's Rick. nice to meet you. This is Rick Upper Chase, Chase. Um, and they are the co-chairs. Is that your two? You, whatever your titles are, I don't know what your titles are. Um, and I think they're going to share some stuff with us about what's going on at the national level. And I think they'd actually like to hear from you all a little bit as well about our thoughts from this region, if we get to that. Yes. And I'm going to say that we are obviously running a little late and we'll probably end this by 5.30 so people can make sure they get down to the uh, yum salmon bay. Um, why don't we just do the regional piece right now and get it over with. So I know that at the Washington State meeting we um, got three folks nominated who said they would serve on national council should there be a vacancy in our region. And I just want to let folks know that they are Kaylee Pruitt Ham, now from Seattle. I know her name tag said Petal Falls, but I'm claiming her. Uh, Douglas Mackey, who is from Olympia, who many of you know from the Afghanistan work that he's been doing. And Liz Moore, um, or someone from PJALS who's in Spokane. So we've got an array across the state of people who are willing to step up should that be something that needs to happen. And I know that at the Oregon meeting, you picked somebody. Anybody from Oregon here? John Roy Wilson. Oh, an unknown. John Roy Wilson. Mm. <laughs> Another wonderful person. So I feel confident that CBIC is sending as a regional four potential wonderful people should the need arise and I'm going to hand this off to you to talk national. Well I got to sit up here in front of you earlier as just myself and, and now I'll sit up here with my hat on of, of uh, National Council Chair. I'm completing a, uh, a term as chair as of the meeting that begins tomorrow uh, and uh, would, would like to tell you a little bit about what National Council has been doing this year. Let's start by reintroducing Rick Ufford Chase as Vice Chair, uh, with whom I can't do this. Uh, and National Council members in the room, uh, we've got, I see Paul, stand up. Would you please, National Council members? Uh, look at them all, please stand up. Uh, Paul DeCar. Uh, Paul Dakar over here on the far side uh, from Ontario, Canada, completing his two terms. Uh, Phil Stolzfus from Minnesota, right? Uh, in the fir your first term. Y you sat down, guys. Come on, back up. Uh, <laughs> Jim Murphy, Ithaca, New York, uh, first term. And Bill Northrup, Tennis Nashville, whom I just met at this meeting, beginning his, his first term. Uh, there are others that you've met, uh, thank you all, there are others that you've met at, at meals and so forth uh, and will continue to meet uh, for the rest of the evening and tomorrow. We also have while we're on it, let's Nash, it. yeah, go, go for it. So Paul, while we've got you here as a captive person, that's not appropriate language, is it? Anyway, Paul, we're glad you're here. And Paul has just finished seven years on the National Council, actually. And th uh, three of those years, Paul, you served as the chair, is that correct? Yeah. Just two. Seemed like three or four. Right? <laughs> uh, and I must say, I came on to the National Council because Paul recruited me, actually, and I came on in the midst of quite a, quite a bit of turmoil and a lot of challenge. And Paul saw us through a very challenging time and into a place that feels extremely healthy for the National Council. So we just want to take a moment to thank Paul with everyone here. And there's this tradition of giving this cheesy thing from Shadowcliff that's hidden under this piece of paper. So Paul, why don't you come up here and receive the traditional we're glad you were with us item. And just if you would all join me in appreciating all the work that Paul has done for all the 